Hi, hello everyone, my name is Mr. Fruit and welcome back to Destiny 2. And in today's video, we're again looking at another Curse of Osiris exotic weapon, this time around, the Crimson. The name is short and to the point, it's a hand cannon, and according to official Vanguard policy, this weapon does not exist. These are not the hand cannons you're looking for. So pretty much, imagine the Red Death just compressed into a hand cannon. That's exactly what this is. And you might be like, well, but it's it. No, but listen. Banned weapon is its intrinsic perk. This weapon fires a three-round burst. Literally still fires a three-round burst. It's just a hand cannon. So it's like the Red Death. But again, a hand cannon. Small bore, increasing range and stability. Accurized rounds, increasing range. Cruel Remedy, being it straight, kills with this weapon. Heal the wielder. Precision kills also refill the magazine. So the whole kill, get healed, again, is just like the Red Death. And then Heavy Grip increases stability, decreases handling speed. So you can look at this. A lot of impact. Lot of range, lot of stability, not a bad reload speed. Honestly, just looking at this thing already, I'm like, ooh, I'm on board. I don't know how the three round burst works. It's probably, it has to be hard to control or maybe something, right? Otherwise, this thing will just be a laser beam. A big thank you to Meek Pigeon for letting me use his Crimson. We're going to be using his Void Walker with Devour, which is apparently also nutty. Your weapon heals you. Your abilities heal you. What doesn't heal you, honestly? And with that said, I am excited to hop on into the Crucible and see how this bad boy works. So far, I have been pleasantly surprised by the two exotics we've played with so far. Obviously, the Burnheart or the Prometheus Lens being the most OP. Now, I just saw a tweet evidently where the Prometheus Lens shipped with a bug or something, which means, hey, whoa, people are having too much fun. Somebody accidentally bumped up the damage a little bit, you know, go figure. So it's definitely going to get nerfed soon, which is unfortunate. Then we have the Colony, which is the grenade launcher, which shoots the homing spiders. Really fun as well. And now we have the Crimson. All of these seemed promising, and so far I haven't been let down. Let's continue the trend. Distant Shore. You know, I keep playing the expansion playlist where I'm supposed to be getting DLC maps, but I just just keep getting Distant Shore. I get it. It was a recently added map, but it's not a part of the expansion, okay? So if we could just remove that, that'd be great. So let's see how this works. Whoa. That is so odd. It's almost like a, almost like a sidearm. I like it. Recoil seems decently easy to control and with that said let's see the damage that we can cause you know it is it is starting to just mess with my mind though going like console pc console pc now you're now you're doing this now you're doing that come on come on there pistol yeah health regen has started now he's probably like haha i have the upper hand no i have the crimson my friend oh my goodness not bad granted he missed a lot of his shots and i wasn't paying attention to how much precision oh wait behind us buddy well, oh <laughs> Uh, well, never mind. He pulled a me. I am... Uh, honestly, it's like my signature move here on Distant Shores. I am really good at falling off the map. I shall avenge you! Okay, so 21 to the face. 19 otherwise at that range. That's not bad. So it would still take three bursts to kill somebody. Gotta land all of them. So it doesn't seem ridiculously overpowered or anything. Still gotta land your shots. It's not gonna kill anyone in two bursts, which would be pretty nutty. Wait a minute, I'm... I'm out of ammo? What? Hello? Um... Game? <laughs> Where? Can I get some primary ammo? Oh, you're telling me that I'm out... I'm out of kinetic. How's that even work? Okay, well, apparently that's the, the gun's flaw. What the heck? Do you have ammo for me? Who has ammo? How do I find it? Don't I? What? Well, um... Hold, please, while I figure this out. Yeah, this SMG's kind of nice, though. Never used it myself. But uh, I'm starting to like it. You know what I might do? I should probably just honestly waste all my SMG shots. Or I could probably just... I'll die here. Okay, that works too. I was going to say I could just run out of SMG shots. And then I think eventually it would give me some more kinetic ammo. Alright, well back to this anyway. So I mean, yeah, really you only get four magazines or five magazines. I don't know, math's hard. But... You, you run through them pretty fast. And, I mean, it takes quite a bit to take somebody out. Oh! But we got it! And actually, I got a precision shot, which reloaded the magazine. Okay, rip. Reloaded the magazine, and it looks like it do It didn't pull from my reserves. Could be wrong. But, I guess that's a good way to keep up on your ammo. It's a good thing to keep in mind. Now, the crimson going in. There we go. Automatic reload. I love it. I love it. And get absolutely destroyed. We devoured. 
So I don't even need to worry about my health. Look at that. I could devour and then get a crimson kill and then just keep going. And they can't stop me because health is nothing but a figment of like it's just a, a fake barrier to me, you know? Nothing shall stop me in my tyranny. Got him. Okay, but unfortunately. Oh, what what is this? What the heck? What the heck? Why just spawn right now? Uh, unfortunately, I took the wrong turn. You know, map quest here put me the wrong way. Man, I remember the day of map quest. When I first started driving, you know, smartphones and GPS weren't really a thing. So you'd have to print directions off map quest. And it was the most confusing thing ever. What the heck? Because it's like, drive approximately 2.2 miles and take a left. And you're driving middle of the night in backwoods. Like, okay, how? What in the world is two and a half miles? Like, I. Is it now? Is it now? And you, so you take a left turn? Okay, that's completely off. I, I shouldn't be talking about it. A little off topic. But point is, I took the wrong turn. That's just a really long-winded way of getting to that, I guess. I'll use the Crimson. I was about to Nova Bomb that dude. But I thought I would pity him. Oh, did we just Mercy Rule? I think we just... Oh, I was about to Nova Bomb. I think we just Mercy Ruled them. Okay. Well, first game. Not too bad. Not too bad. How'd we end? Second on the leaderboard. Okay, with a 4.33 efficiency. Gabe, though, was just just going in. Gabe's Gabe's possessed. Gabe, what, uh, what are you using here? That. <laughs> okay, I now know why Gabe has so many kills. Like, people don't understand. If you haven't played PvP right now, or you haven't played against a Prometheus Lens, people are sleeping on how strong this thing is. Like, I am not. If you watched my video, go watch it if you haven't. It freaking melts. It does. It has to have the fastest time to kill in the entire PvP. Like, it, it has to. There's no way. But it, it, it'll get nerfed. And I, I mean, if they're not going to buff everything else, then obviously it does need to be tuned a little bit. It is a little nutty. But I don't know. It's nice for a few days to just... It, it reminds me of back when the Vex Mytho classed in D1, right after the raid. The few people that had it got to enjoy it in Crucible when it was... A monster. That thing melted. Kind of reminds me of that. So I'm a big fan of you so far, Crimson. You, you you could use a little more bullets, I guess. Doesn't seem like you would be very helpful in PvE. I mean, kinetic ammo, I guess, drops pretty frequently. So maybe it's not that big of a deal. You could deal with the lower mobs. You know, smaller mobs. Do, do whatever you want. <laughs> do what you want and what you want with your body. Do what you want and what you want with your body. <laughs> what you want with your body. Okay, is it like, this has to be a joke. See, Distant Shore again. Where are my DLC maps? I paid for DLC maps. Gosh dang it. Whatever. Clash it is. My fabulous looking warlock. Literally everything I do can heal me. Anything and everything. My primary weapon. My abilities. I have an exotic helmet that helps my void abilities and somehow. But I'm not a warlock, so I'm not entirely familiar with it. But point is, Devour Lock is nutty. I stand by... My, see, okay, so that's not, see, it's not bad. But I'm not sitting here like, man, you know, this thing is OP. Like I would. Because, again, it, it kills about as fast as, like, better devils would. Except with this one, you have to make sure you're pretty much hitting all three of the burst. Which is harder, and at range, hard to do. So, I don't know, besides the healing thing, honestly, this feels pretty mediocre. I don't want to say mediocre, I mean, I like it. Don't get me wrong, but I'm not, I'm not shouting OP, but what I am shouting OP about is the healing. That's what I love about it. You can get a little frisky, you know, you can, you can push the limits. You can test your, oh my God, did you just, look at how fast I died. That is the Prometheus lens. We're dying against the guy who got like seven bajillion kills last round with it. So if we run across him, we just kind of accept death unless he's weak or he's missing his shots, his time to kill will beat us every time. Like, there's there's really, there's nothing else to it. That's what, that's just how the cookie crumbles, my friends. What you got? What, what, what you using right there, huh? What you got? Ain't nothing good enough for me, though. I could grab this sword, which is tempting, but uh, actually I won't, because whoever this is already grabbed it. You have a rocket launcher. Well played. I could have looked in the, in the little kill feed and been like, hey, this person loaded this, and I would have been like, oh, well, I'm going to avoid that, but I was too I was too zoned in. I was like, I don't care what he has. I'm going to outplay him. Just watch. Now watch. This is going to be the Prometheus lens. Okay, it was not. Uh, now I just now I just look silly. Come here. No, not today, you nerd. 
Okay, hold on. You, you gonna help me out here? Thank you. Oh, we got Devour going. Devour with this? Oh. Everything and anything is stacking right now. And the Prometheus lens is actually ridiculous. I was doing well with it on console. I can't imagine on PC where tracking is so much easier. Oh. Honestly, the thought kind of frightens me. No wonder dude's killing it. He probably has got 0.5 KD. Jesus, dude, look at how fast. I mean, granted, you know, that was a whole squad. But, like, good God. I, I stand by the fact that right now anyone could pick up a Prometheus lens. Doesn't matter who you are. Doesn't matter how good you are. What? I'm getting a call from Canada. Yeah, I'm just going to say no to that one. I don't know who you are. I live in America. Home, home of the brave. Oh, I'm going to get him. I get, yes! I might have still died because of that ridiculous burn, but I smote him as well. If I'm going to go down, I'm going to take you down with me, Gabe. That's your name, right? Yes, Gabe. Gabe with a Y. Now, I know you want this power. Oh my god, there's more of you than I thought there was. If I could just not sack a big fat PP, actually, even if I'd hit a few of those bullets I missed, I still think we would have died. But anyway, that's all you need to do sometimes in the fight like that. Get a clutch kill, bada bing, bada boom, health regeneration, you keep rolling. Roll with the punches, cause you know that it's inevitable to be unforgettable. It's uh, one of my favorite bands. Um, underrated. That is a rocket launcher. They are. Wrecking us right now with the Vudge. It's uh, unfortunate. Whoever has Prometheus Lens, their team wins. Confirmed. I think we can uh, just pack that up. <laughs> My friend sees the rocket launcher, just stops him from like that. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, and there is Storm Trance right on top of me. Didn't even have a time or a chance to react. Okay. Can I just fight somebody without the Prometheus Lens right now? Because it makes the Crimson look all right. But then... You make you go up against it's it's like you know the more attractive sister alone the the younger sister you know she's like oh yeah she's she's pretty attractive but then you see your older sister and you're like oh my gosh it's like it's like they're not even the same people you know and that's that's kind of how it is crimson they're like oh wow yeah no oh, what the fudge point is everything's gonna look bad when you compare it to the Prometheus lens. So take that out of the factor. Remember the first game where it went well. And remember this game where, oh, dude, look at how fast that kills. That is, that is actually ridiculous. That is nutty. I didn't realize, I, I should try it on PC because yeah, I think it's gonna be even crazier. And, and we're kind of seeing, how many rocket launchers can we die from this game? Let's get a running count. Let's let's. It's a little mini game. You know, it's a challenge. Hey, how many times can we die to a rock launcher? Let's see. A one, a two, a three, three. Oh goodness gracious! I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do. They're pulling. They're so far ahead at this point, too. Good God! Come on, Crimson! Don't let me down. I can't see this man. Come on, get the health regen. Yeah! Oh. There's two- oh, it's the Prometheus lens. I was like, wow, I died fast. I wonder what it was. And I was like, wait, no, no, I don't. I know exactly what it was. The cursed Prometheus lens. Curse you and all that you stand for. Listen, you only need one more kill. So I got this. Yo, how- Oh, okay. <laughs> Already dead. That's my bad. Hey, look at that two legendary So Now, I can only imagine how many kills Gabe got. I'm going to say he got like more than half of that. And in Clash. Probably got like 30, honestly. Let's see. See how much he was fragging. Gabe, 33. Yeah. As you can tell, literally changed the entire face of that game. Without Gabe, it wouldn't have been such a landslide. But with Gabe, was it wasn't even fair. So the second game, not the greatest showing. And we all know why. But outside of that, I do think this has some potential. I think really the only draw here is the healing. The three round burst and everything doesn't make this OP. It would still take three rounds or three bursts of landing about every shot to ensure you get a kill. So time to kill pretty much lines up with every other thing, except actually I think this kind of has a disadvantage because if you miss some of those bullets out of the burst, if you only hit one or two out of the burst, and you're missing out a lot of damage and your time to kill is gonna go down significantly. So especially at range, it struggles. But again, you heal, and it looks cool. So, you know, it, it's a toss-up. Regardless, I'd love to have you a part of my arsenal if you'll have me, Crimson. Unfortunately for now, you're kind of, the spotlight's kind of being stolen by the Prometheus lens, but don't worry. Once it's nerfed, you might have your day. 
Potentially. I Honestly, I can't say either way. Maybe you won't, but you're cool anyway. With that said, thank you very much for watching. Have yourselves a fantastic day. I'll talk to you in the next one. Farewell.